Hi everyone, welcome to the Grace Life guys. So in this video, we're going to decorate, we're going to be decorating this mug. This mug, I was going to give it away as a gift, but uh, I'm not really sure. It all depends on how it comes out guys, <laughs> otherwise I might keep it. But we're going to be um, embellishing this and it is going to be a Chanel mug. So let's see. Let's see what how this turns out, guys. Okay, let's jump right into the video. So I printed out the, the Chanel logo with the word Chanel off the printer. As you can see, I've been using a lot of Chanel lately. Then I, I decided to cut out a little one right here. This is going to go on the mug. And so I tried to trim that down as best as I could. Okay, because all I need really is that portion there. So then we're also going to be using these labels from the Dollar Tree, okay? Then of course the mug came from the Dollar Tree also. We are gonna be using this gold. Um, it's like a beaded pearl. Uh, they have the pearl wrap, and so now they have the gold wrap, and they also have the silver, metallic silver one. So we're gonna be using this one. You can get that at the Dollar Tree. I, I may uh, scatter some gems. Uh, just because you know we like that bling and then we're going to Mod Podge the Chanel you know because it is on paper we're going to Mod Podge that so that it sticks there and we don't have to worry about that falling off let's pick out a label from in here let's jump right into the video guys everything I'm using to create this craft is down in the description box below so okay so I think I believe I already decided to use uh, this one right here okay it looks like it fits perfectly so that's the one that we're going to use now before I peel it off of there what I would like to do is just kind of semi place that with the Mod Podge in that circle here just so that when I peel it off it's already kind of stuck on there I don't need to wet this because this is Xerox paper guys, so I only uh, wet the cardstock because of how thick it is. So I'm gonna place this right in the center where I where I you know I feel happy here. You can move it around, and so now you see that it's placed, and I can peel it back. So when I go to seal everything, it's already on there. See what I mean? So. And even then, I still have plenty of time to maneuver and to set that. So I like to place it. Normally, I drink my coffee uh, with my right hand. So I would like to place it where people could see it. So I'm going to say, you know, you find the placement that you like. And then you lay that down. Okay. Now, I'm only going to use enough Mod Posh to seal right in that area, right there. No more, no less. Okay, and that's what that looks like so far. Doesn't that look nice, guys? I'm absolutely loving it. So, we're just going to use a little bit. Just so that the Chanel doesn't peel up and it stays where it's supposed to. And I'm not even going to come off the label. Okay guys, so I'm happy with that. So we're just gonna leave that alone. Let me close this. And while that's drying, guys, I'm gonna go ahead, I'm gonna measure around that mug. Well, it depends on how I wanted to do this. Wait a minute, because what I can do, instead of going around the whole mug, I can pretty much just go around that label, guys. I think I like that idea better, so. Let me go ahead and do that. I'm going to cut off that little portion there. And I think a row of two is good. So. So what I would like to do, guys, is I would like to... 
I don't like this to move, so I always get scissors to hold that down. I mean, to stop it from moving. Place a gold border along the top and one along the bottom. Clean the glue strings off later, guys. Let's just get this lined up here. paper towel here. I'll pick up the glue strings, but I'm not finished yet. I just want to get some of that off. So I'm going to go ahead and cut off another piece just to do the sides. Okay, guys, this is more of a decor piece, guys. But just in case, I am gonna go back. There is a Mod Podge that is dishwasher safe, so just in case, I am gonna go back and reseal it with that one. I don't have it handy in front of me right now, but um, I'm gonna do that just in case, okay. But other than that, look at this. This is absolutely gorgeous, guys. It makes a great gift. A great gift idea, guys. And I absolutely love Chanel. Hold on one second. Just trying to get those glue strings out of the way here. So this is what we have. Guys, thank you so much for watching the video. Everything I used to create this down in the description box below. I hope you enjoy the video. Click like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you in the next video.